How can you tell the difference between joint pain from psoriatic arthritis and that from rheumatoid arthritis? They can look very similar at first, but there's some key differences. First, look at the joint patterns. Rheumatoid arthritis usually affects the small joints of your hands and your feet, and they tend to be symmetrical. So if your right hand is affected, your left hand is probably affected as well. Psoriatic arthritis, on the other hand, tends to be asymmetrical. It might just affect one side, or even a single finger or toe, making them have this sausage-like appearance. This is called dactylitis. Now check for skin changes. Psoriatic arthritis often comes with psoriasis. You've seen a commercial on TV for the medications. Those red scaly patches on your scalp, your elbows, your knees, or your back. You might also see changes in your nails like pitting or lifting. Rheumatoid arthritis, on the other hand, usually doesn't involve the skin unless it's medication side effects. What about lab findings? In rheumatoid arthritis, blood tests often show a positive rheumatoid factor or anti-CCP antibodies. In psoriatic arthritis, these tests are usually negative. Doctors rely more on symptoms, skin examination, and sometimes imaging to confirm psoriatic arthritis. Both conditions need early treatment to protect your joints. But knowing which one that you're dealing with helps the doctors pick the right treatment plan. Save this video for later and comment below. Do your symptoms sound more like rheumatoid arthritis or psoriatic arthritis?